This year at Wealthy Education Center, we are investigating and diving into big picture learning for our young people. We are really now implementing a structure that is truly alternative. It's really just allowing young people an opportunity to learn about things that they want to learn about, things that they're interested in, their passions. Also, it's about sort of breaking the mold of learning has to happen in a building because it doesn't. We want them to be exposed to things that maybe they wouldn't be if they were in a traditional setting or their parents can't transport them. It's just providing young people an opportunity to see truly what the world is outside of these four walls and maybe outside of our small community. So implementation year for us started with a new schedule. So we have a semi-traditional schedule, Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and then Tuesday, Thursday has two large advisory blocks. And in those advisories, students do everything from team building um, to culture building in our, in our school to then exploring who they are. And that's a concept within Big Picture that students really need to know who they are and their their story and be able to talk to that so that when they do go out in the world now or as a graduate uh, they're confident in who they are so students are doing projects around that they're writing autobiographies and then they're diving into interests they could be around um, things they like to do or it could be things they want to do in the future could be career related could not be career related the ultimate goal however is to get them engaged in something outside of school that would be a what's after high school kind of next step. So get them into internships, um, job shadows, so that when they walk away with a diploma, they actually kind of have a, have a path where they're going and, and maybe even a foot in the door um, as to what's next for them in the, the next step in life. If they don't know for a lot of students, we will offer them a lot of leaving to learn experiences where they can get out and they can just go see what, what is available and what's out there because sometimes you don't know what you don't know. And then from there, they do their independent kind of exploration with that, maybe with the help of their advisory teacher. Then they reach out to potential locations for job shadows. Then it would be, what do we look at for an internship? And those would hopefully be at least a semester long. Each quarter, no matter what they're doing in this cycle of learning, they give an exhibition of learning. So they get to present to their family, their peers, their instructors, their mentors out in the outside world. And that's how we're awarding right now elective credit. We are teaching in advisory to some of the critical skills, the skills that are the ones that are gonna be lasting in what employers want in the future. So things like being problem solvers, communicators, um, having empathy, and that could come in the form of, you know, how do you build an effective resume? How do you use email? We're just really excited about this endeavor that we're, we're engaging in. Um, it's really fun to see students light up and, and family members too. We've heard from a lot that a lot of people say, where was this when I was a student? If we can bring anyone from the outside in or get students out to them, that's what we're trying to do. So if we could have folks come in and if they want to do a, a two to four to eight week mini unit here, like come in every Tuesday, Thursday in the afternoon for an hour each time, maybe lead some yoga or show how to build a bench or I mean, whatever the skill may be, we certainly invite that. And then if anybody has, um, any space and interest in having students come to them for whatever purpose, to job shadow, to internship, we'd love for them to reach out to us here at Welty.